in the previous tutorial we downloaded and installed the uh, NS client on our uh, Windows server now we will connect it to the host the first thing we have to do is go into our commands if we ls in here we see that we have the commands configuration file in here let's open that with this command and in here we'll have to look first for the uh, check underscore nt and once we find it we will edit that to add the password that we copied I have the password in here I'll put that in here and copy this part and add it here this is not our command let's look again for uh, check underscore nt this is it let's add it here paste and this is it let's save the file now that's done we have the password we can access the uh, remote windows server all we have to do is if we ls now here we will see the windows file in here we can access that let's you let's do sudo vim and open the windows configuration file in here we just have to put our ip instead i just copied the ip and paste it here let's save this now and then we will open the uh, Nagios configuration file and look for windows we have the windows thingy in here let's add it's it's there so let's just uncomment it and save everything looks okay this path was there we just uncommented and now we will verify it says that we have 16 services and three hosts and we don't have any warnings or errors let's restart the service once that is done we can go into our nagios refresh and go to hosts we have three hosts in here the last one is the windows server and it's up if we go to the services we will see that it has some services but they're pending in a while some of them will be okay some will be critical some will be uh like unknown or has a warning in it you can see all of that in here this is it for this tutorial see you in the next one